Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? No, I think that's the better option. Left. Which way is left? There you go. Prescott, please come to the front office. Thank you. So let's actually read the poster, see if I didn't actually just read it. Rachel Amber. She looks so hopeful and pretty. I wonder what happened to her. I know what happened. Um, so she's been missing since Monday, April 22nd. She's 19. Five foot five. Uh, tattoo on cuff for a dragon and a star on the inside of left wrist. Those posters really are everywhere. Um, there's Bert, there's Hayden. Let's go talk to Hayden first. Hi Hayden! Can I talk to you? Back up. There you go. Hey Hayden. There she is! The retro selfie master. That's me alright. You look relaxed as usual, Hayden. It's a skill one cultivates at Blackwell. Especially when one represents the Vortex Club. Not to boast. What the hell is the Vortex Club anyway? It seems so elitist. Only if you're not cool enough to get in. And it doesn't hurt your resume. If you say so. I do. But you should actually come hang with us one night, then you wouldn't be so inclined to gossip. <laughs> I don't think so. I'm not Miss Party. That's because you haven't partied with us. Or even Victoria, who's pretty funny when she's baked. It seems weird to think about partying with all those Rachel Amber posters up. You're high. Rachel used to hang out with us too. She was a blast. Smart, not bitchy like, you know. So you knew Rachel Amber? I knew she liked to party. <laughs> Fun to be around. Oh yeah, and she was hot. Rachel was actually a member of the Vortex Club? No. Rachel was like her own club. She was actually too cool for us. And I'll deny I ever said that. What do you think happened to her? Um, uh, whatever happens to people who disappear without a trace. Uh, did Victoria like Rachel? Did Victoria like Rachel? She seems like the jealous type. Don't think you know Victoria so well. She respected Rachel, even if she didn't act like it. Nathan Prescott. Do you really want Nathan Prescott to represent? Oh, please. Nathan is like everybody's voodoo doll. Kill the rich kid. He's all right and a fun guy to hang with. Fuck the haters. Fair enough, but I'm still not going to party with him. Your loss, bro, is fucking hilarious when he's blazed. Pretty and sure he does hilarious. always have the best shit. Let's talk later, Hayden. Bye, Max. No, I have to get my chemical on and study. We should get you and Dana out one night. Sure. Well, there's a shark thing over there. I Oh, Warren. Hello. Goodness. Um. Okay, so it starts from here. Um, hi Max, can you get my flash drive? I need some info and space. Hello. Sorry running late, insane day. I'll meet you in the lot, looking cool. You'll see. The camera will be ready to see you shortly. I hope so. Okay, I better get to my dorm and grab that flash drive. Let's see if I can take a picture of this graffiti. Zero bucks. Ew, gross. At least switch to e cigs No, don't do that. Uh, they're just, well, they're not just as bad, but they're just. Oh, that's not different. nice. Poor little otter. Place the poster, poster. I don't really want to see the posters. Leaflet. 
Is it about what? I'm sure this poster has stopped millions of bullies. Hmm. Okay. Uh, actually, let's have a quick look in the journal. So, we know a bit more about Nathan and David. Who else? No, nope. I pressed the wrong button. And Principal Wells. Whatever. Um, yeah, let's have a look at photos. Because, uh, yeah, as I say, there's a statue one. Broken skateboard. <laughs> a squirrel sipping some cola. And a window with a teddy bear. Okay. I know where to get the statue one, because that's one, that's one right there, but I missed that one. Oh, let's go. Brooke. Mm, might as well talk to you. Sigh. Hi, Brooke. Let me guess. You want to fly my drone? Sure. I'd love to. I love planes and balloons and... This is neither. Do you know what a drone really is? A weapon, right? Uh, you read too many conspiracy sites. This might be too complicated for you. Funny. Warren said you were smart. Please, step back. Oh, bitch. Hi, Miss Grant. Excuse me, Max. I know everybody loves being asked to sign a petition, but would you do Miss Grant a favor and hear me out? Of course. Sure, I always have time for you. What's the petition? David Madsen, our chief of security, wants to put surveillance cameras all around the campus. Halls, classrooms, gym, dorm rooms, etc. Blackwell Academy should be a high school, not a high security penitentiary. Agreed. That's crazy. I get why school should be on high alert these days, but cameras in the dorm rooms... Mm. It's a slippery slope. And it's up to you and your classmates to stand up here. Blackwell Academy has a noble heritage. From the Native Americans who founded this land, to the pioneers who shared it in peace. Not fear and violence. Oh, Native Americans, eh? The Native Americans? The tribes who were here first, who welcomed the settlers. Both cultures found a mutual symbiosis and thrived. Now, before I assign you homework with this lecture, will you please sign the petition to keep our campus from going back to 1984? Good Absolutely. I don't mind security, but not pure surveillance. Mm -hmm. I knew you were my favorite new student at Blackwell for a good reason. <laughs> Thanks, Miss Grant. Hey there, Stella. Hey, I know you. You're the new quiet girl in Jefferson's class. Isn't he incredible? Sure. I think so. We're lucky to have such a famous teacher. And I actually love his work. Me too. His New York urban stuff is great, but I'm glad he came back to his Oregon roots. Screw the East Coast elite. Mm. It must piss off those pretentious galleries that Mark Jefferson is teaching photography to us Blackwell Hicks. Plus, he is pretty hot for an older guy. Ew. If Victoria wasn't all over him, I would definitely make a move. Victoria? Victoria is pretty obvious. I don't think Jefferson is into her. I don't think she's closed the deal, but she's not the only player. Now, how do you know this? Yeah. You have a lot to learn here at Blackwell. Rachel Amber absolutely had sex with him. Hmm. Well, I heard that from a good source. And this good source is? Rachel. <clears throat> so, you knew Rachel? Not really. I saw her hanging with the other cool kids like Victoria. Not my kind of clique. But I heard insane stories about Rachel. Like? Um, okay. Awesome panel, don't want to see that. Let's talk to the skater dudes. Hi, Justin. 
Yo, Justin. Check out the Max. Come to Thrash? 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 You mean stage diving or? You're such a poser. If you can't even name a simple nose slide or a tray flip, you should walk on. Okay. Oh, wrong button. Okay, so we need to rewind that. Because I'm pretty sure the photo here from the escape room will give me this. Yo, Justin. Check out the max. I came to no slide. But I'd love to see somebody do a tree flip. Mm. Oh, sick. You're not a poser. Damn nah, right. I just can't skate worth shit. Oh, check it. We're gonna destroy some rails for you. What do you want to see? Mm, let's do the no slide. I'd love to see a no slide. Let's get Trevor all over that action. <laughs> Damn it, he did it. Yo, just check out the map. It's no slide. I came to know. Oh, sick. Nah. Hard. Oh. the tree flip. Go for a tree flip. Let's get Trevor all. Come on, break the skateboard, break the skateboard, oh, break it. Oh. Damn it. Ooh. You alright, dude? I wonder how you get the broken skateboard then. Hey! I'm stoked to see those photos framed and shit. You're not really a skate Betty though. Not really. <laughs> not really. Too bad. It's nice to have the females on board too. Rachel, Amber, and her punk friend used to love skating with us. Who was Rachel's punk friend? I can't remember her name. She was hot. Tats, blue hair, hardcore. She stopped hanging out with us after Rachel disappeared. I <laughs> ran away. You knew Rachel? She used to chill with us sometimes. But one day she just vanished. I hope she's living the dream somewhere. And if anybody hurt her, we'll get a skate posse and take them out with our boards. <laughs> Let's chill later, Justin. Anytime you want to take some action shots, we're here for you, Max. Okay. I don't know how to get the broken skateboard, but whatever. It's not that big of a deal. Alright, let's talk to Daniel. Hey, What's dude. up, Daniel? Oh, hi, Max. Could I, um, ask you a question? Would you mind letting me sketch you? I do put my sketches on Facebook, though. I'd be honored, Daniel. Makes me feel like a muse. Funny you should say that. I was just thinking about my real muse. Rachel Amber. Oh, no bit of a crush on her, didn't you? Uh, you knew her? You knew her? No, but once she asked me to draw her portrait, oh, she was a natural. Hard to avoid her posters all over campus. Kills me to see her sweet face used as a crime photo. Ah, she had a good heart. What do you mean, has? So what happened to her? There's got to be a story. She just stopped coming to class. Some people said she ran away. Some say she jumped off a cliff. I just hope she's okay. Okay. Why don't you start drawing me? Even though I must be a step down from Rachel. No way! You're a good substitute, Muse. Great line. Oh, that's a good posture. <laughs> good. Good. A little bit creepy. Best portrait ever. Thanks, ma'am. Actually, no consequences. 
I don't care. There's a dude over there. There's a guy over here. Is that Taylor? No, nope. can't talk to her anyway. Let us go talk to this dude. Over here. Graffiti. Clever. <laughs> Luke. Hi, Luke. Uh, hello? Max, I don't feel like talking. Oh, sorry, dude. Oh, sorry. I won't bother you. Let's talk later, okay, Max? Max, I don't feel... What's wrong? What's wrong? Nathan Prescott, little rich bitch kid. He thinks he can own people like his parents own Blackwell. Like he owns the Vortex Club. Yes, he's a nasty piece of work. You, you know him? Not really. Not really, I've seen him around. Sounds like you know way more than that. Max, tell me. Nope, he's just an entitled dick with a lot of money. Not my type. Somebody needs to take that prick down. Gladly. It'll happen. It'll happen. Karma doesn't play favorites. Yeah, history always proves that, right? Just wait for justice, you sheeple. Okay, and last but not least, the lovely person, Evan, who I love. Because he reminds me of someone that I used to go to school with. Hey, Evan. Mind if I check out your cool portfolio? Let's see if you're worthy of it, Max. You'll have to answer a simple question. Who photographed the famous fallen soldier? Oh. I want to say it's Robert Isn't it Robert Dorno? Oh, my. You can't even tell the difference between street photography and photojournalism. No portfolio peak for you. Damn it. I want to see. Uh, hey, F. Let's see if you're. Is it Eugene Smith? Gotta be Eugene Smith. Well, they both were famous war photographer images, but you should know the difference. Damn it. Good try. Wrong answer. Hey, Evan. Let's see if... It must be Robert Kappa, then. Robert Kappa, of course. I love his work, despite the controversy about that photo. My, my. This quiet child knows things. Yeah! That's why I'm here. You're a kindred spirit, Max. Would you care for a perusal of my portfolio? Yes. It's not a privilege I grant to many. I'd be honored, sir. These photos are great. And Rachel Amber's face is mesmerizing. Hmm. Yeah, quite cool. So you must have known Rachel. Hi, Evan. As you can see, Rachel Amber was my favorite model here. She knew exactly what angles worked best with my eye. What was she like? What was she like? She was like mercurial. You know what that means. Of course I do, you snob. I know, I can be a little diva. What do you think happened to her? Nothing good, Max. Nothing good. Mm. I'd say it. Right, anyway, I think that's pretty much everything, so let's just go.